I think Pat Tillman, his sacrifice is unbelievable, but how he passed away is not the story. How he lived and the way he treated people is truly how he made a bigger impact. I watched him play in the Rose Bowl when I was like six, seven years old. Pat Tillman had a sense of duty. I mean, he turned down a multi-million dollar contract. He gave up all of that just to go and serve his country. He had zero ego. You know, he, he was a guy that wanted to be in the background. He would be, you know, I'm just another guy. He was, you know, that kind of guy. He was an individual that always tried to make the people around him better. When you look into the eyes of people who've known Pat Tillman, who have experienced what he's all about, there is a special place in their heart for how he's impacted their life individually. I think it's worth stretching that he was an exceptionally smart man, and that I don't think people appreciate. He was very serious about learning. I met Pat in January of 1995. He was a freshman. And I had just taken a position with the athletic department in the academic counseling area. He graduated in three and a half years. He graduated with honors. So he was close to a 3.9 GPA, I believe, when he, when he finished. Whatever he did, it was about excellence. He had so much passion and he was so smart. He was always the smartest person in the room, but he didn't feel the need to tell you that. When my department head said to me, look, you know, I want you to take this guy on because I think he's special, I'm, I'm a bit skeptical. But a couple of conversations in, it's pretty obvious. This is a rare intellect. This is a rare mind. I would say to him, you need to read this. And I figured this is going to take a major. You know, a month later, he's, had, he's digested the entire thing. Between practices, he was a guy that wanted to learn and make himself better, learn more about the human race and make society better. I always took for granted that Pat was going to be in the U.S. House, U.S. Senate, that, that he was going to be a political leader. There we would be, you know, in my office or some coffee house someplace, arguing politics. It was, it was a mutual respect. He was a no-excuse guy. He did the work. He took time for people, and he constantly wanted to get better. He never wanted to stay the same. When you step on campus, it's, it's apparent that Pat Tillman's legacy is around you. This is one of the aspects of the Pat Tillman legacy that we want to pass on to our students. You can be an outstanding individual in multiple areas during the course of your lifetime. For me, when you see that, that you can be successful in multiple chapters of your life, that to me is refreshing. Being a veteran, I'm certainly proud of. Being a part of something greater than myself, Pat Tillman was definitely about that. Pat Tillman's ability to sacrifice sacrifice for the greater good of everyone else. I think everybody kind of admires that. That's a big portion that I share with him is that motivation of striving for excellence in everything we do. It's too easy to just give up. Pat kind of had the mentality where he never gave up. He never shied away from hard stuff and I never shy away from hard stuff. I'm always trying to push myself. He brought together people, his events bring people together. The great thing about Arizona State University is we are important to the community, the community is important to us. We all have ASU blood running through us so we look for things, I think, to, to bring us together, and Pat can do that better than anyone else. If we can connect our students with that mentality, that kind of growth mindset, that they can not only continue growing, but they can help the people around them grow also, there's a lot of power in that. Everything that the Pat Tillman Veteran Center stands for is probably the reason why I'm still at ASU. The center represents everything that's good about human connection and knowing that no matter where you've been that you can if you if you have the right assets around you that you can be successful